Yeah, guys, coming through, please. Excuse me. Guys, coming through, please. Excuse me. Yeah, I'll do the interview. Yeah. Come on up in here. Oh my god. Okay. What's up, bro? How are you? Very well. Very well. What's going on? What's up, Jessica? Jamie. Nice to meet you. Jessica. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Now you're fine. Traffic is crazy. We just have a couple questions for you. All right. So, where are you at tonight? I'm here, this is Stingaree, baby. We full throttle. It's the official party of Comic-Con right here. Official, all the other stuff is appetizers. This is the main course meal, it's going down. Great, so can you tell us what readers can expect from Mayhem? Um, look around you, there's a whole lot of mayhem, a lot of sexy mayhem over here. Full throttle, it's good energy. No, for real, um, <laughs> that's the party mayhem. Um, my comic book is coming out August 5th. Um, we had a special edition cover, variant cover for, for Comic-Con. Uh, we were selling it two weeks early. Um, I think we probably sold well over 4,000 comic books in three days. And, um, you know, it's been a, a great, amazing experience. There's a lot of Hollywood types that come out here who only come out to uh, greet the comic book fans and geeks and nerds, as they call them, um, from panels. But I was out there with the people about seven, eight hours a day. That's why I don't even have a voice right now. Letting them know that Mayhem was here to comic book. So I'm fired up, really passionate about this. And I'm just really honored that the, the fans have been embracing my movement on the level that they have. We got Stan Lee coming here tonight. We got Jim Lee here. We got Todd McFarlane, um, Robert Kirkman. All of the comic book heavyweights is here. And um, it's just amazing to get love on this level. And what's been your inspiration to start this whole Mayhem movement? Comic-Con. It happened last year when I was out here for Death Race. And so instead of me, you know, showing love to the comic book fans for supporting like Transformers and all of my films that were comic books first, you know, for me, it's just a natural progression for me to say, I want to create something to contribute to this world. And so here we go. We got birth. We gave birth to man. What's been the craziest thing you've seen since you've been out here for Comic-Con? Well, it's probably going to be this party. Because, you know, for me, I love the guys and all the love from the fellas, but it's been real sausage heavy out here, and I'm just looking to come in this party. And come on, y'all, come on, ladies, get up in here. Let's go. Come on up in here, let them in here. We don't like sexy people waiting outside. You keep all these fellas waiting all you want. Get these ladies up in here. Come on, ladies, let's go. Come on, ladies, come on, ladies, let's go. You can wait out here and pay $500 if you want to. You gotta get up in here while you can, let's go. All the ladies right here, let's go. Come on up in here. So growing up, which superhero was your favorite? Who'd you want to be? Uh, you know, for me, I, you know, honestly, I was more a cartoon guy. I definitely had, I watched uh, Transformers and Voltron. I watched uh, He-Man. Those were my characters that I could relate to and identify with. I wasn't necessarily a comic book guy because, you know, we, we just didn't have comic books. That wasn't really our thing. Hold on one second. <laughs> Ain't it cool? Yo, yo, yo. Come on up in here, man. Come on up in here. My man, come on, let's go. You got glasses? Yeah, come on, come on, come on. What's up, buddy? Why? It's a little, why do you keep it's a little, it's a little crazy to get up in there, so come on in here while you can. Who you with? I'm with, I'm with all the indie cool guys. We're about to go grab some food. Oh, okay, well, go ahead. With me. We going all night, baby. Stan Lee and Jim Lee upstairs. Got all right. Here. One last all question right. for you. Can you give us a shout out to E and the Daily 10, your folks over there? E and the Daily 10 got nothing but love for y'all. Uh, come on up in here. I want some exclusive footage for y'all <laughs> checking out this party. It's so sexy. You can't miss it. Let's go eat. Right, come follow me. <laughs> <laughs> Real quick. Absolutely. Sorry. Yeah. All right. All right. Here we go. How we go. She got the camera and the mic. I like this. Renaissance woman. I'm here to contribute to the comic books that they read. I'm here to contribute to this legacy, to this world. The septic cars mobilized. My man, you're the greatest. That's what I'm here for. That's what it's all about. I have to tell about this. Who is this guy? Sorry, man. Sorry. Hold tight, man. Can you get him out of the back of the picture? Here we go. All right. Ready? Three, two, three. All right. All right. Come on in. All right. Come on in. All right. Well, come in.
a fucking record, man. If you got love for Jay-Z, put the diamonds in the air. Put the motherfucking diamonds in the air, man. DJ, put that record on one quick. When they get in a fire, I'm here. Music is still the one supplier. Higher than a piece of paper, man, my name. Got the highest chick in the game, boy, my chance. So clap, so clap, so clap, so clap, so clap.